receipts? Do I need to bring the receipts, oh, baby girl? Because oh, no. I got receipts. Oh, no. Do you That's want me to bring the receipts? Do I need to bring the receipts, oh, no. baby girl? I don't have any time for any gossip now. Okay. Eh? Yes. Hey guys, we are back for another video. We are not done with Miss Dr. Heavenly Hail Kimes because Mariah stated that she had the receipts. She stated that she had the receipts. Now, I don't believe Mariah is a liar. Now, I don't know her personally, but Mariah and Dr. Heavenly is definitely two different people, but I have never saw Mariah get ghetto. We know Dr. Heavenly get ghetto every time she opened her mouth. Mariah said that she had the receipts and she also stated she can bring the receipts on Dr. Damon. Now, let me put this disclaimer out there. I, I mean, I like him. I don't know him. I don't know anything about his background. I don't even know what he does. But what we do know is Dr. Heavenly is on this show. And if she's not doing anything else, one of the things that she does very well is she deflects. She deflects, she deflects, she deflects. And fans and people are saying something is going on with her because she works too hard to not have her life on the show. So it's almost like she works overtime to be full of hell, full of mess, and full of trouble so that she does not have to talk about her own life. And people have stated like, you know, is he like, how, how are they together? Yes, they seem like, cold and hot water, but not necessarily because I see a lot of couples like this. But what we, the viewers, want to see, we want to see your real life. We don't want you to be on the show causing hell in everybody else's life while deflecting in your own life. And as we saw in that first video snippet, Mariah said she can bring the receipts. She said she has the receipts. And she also said Dr. Damon pretty much begged her to not show those receipts. And y'all know what? I think I believe her. So let's get into this video. Now, Dr. Hill has stated that her man, Dr. Damon Daddy, is not doing anything and has not done anything. She's also stated that all of the other wives, their husband has cheated on them, including CISO, including Curtis, including, I don't know, she's just talking out the side of her neck at this point um, because we don't even know that Cecil cheated. They said he had a special friend. He never said that him and that lady um, had anything else. Um, she also said that Dr. G cheated. So I don't know, but she says that her Dr. Damon daddy is not a cheater. Um, so we're going to get into this video and you guys let me know what you think. Okay, guys, so what I would like to jump in, I would like to jump into the Married to Medicine reunion part two, specifically when the men were talking and Dr. Damon wanted um, Dr. G to basically confirm that he wasn't a cheater. Now, what Dr. G said is, I don't know what you do, but Dr. Damon was not accepting that. He's like, no, I'm not a cheater. So I thought that was a little odd for you as a grown ass man wanting another man to confirm if you're a cheater or not. As like you guys are Siamese twins and conjoined at the arm and hip or something. So I wanna get into that very uncomfortable conversation um, with regards to the part two reunion. Obviously guys, I can't play um, the actual video and I could not find any snippets of it. So I'm gonna play the audio. So I'm gonna have that audio coming up next. I know him for 10 years. So you think I'm a cheater to say? Bruh, I don't know what you're doing. No, don't don't play like you ain't known him for 10 years. Do you think it or not? 
Do I think that you yeah. cheated? I don't know. Nobody knows the inner work. Man, no, I just asked you one question, man. It's either a yes or no. Greg, that sounds it's a little evasive. Yeah. If he is a yes or no, he has a yes or no question. And it's a yes or no. I would say no. Now, guys, I can say for me, Dr. Damon pressing on Dr. G, making him pretty much say that he's not a cheater was a little weird to me because if you know that you're not a cheater, why do you need someone else to say it? If you're not a cheater, you're not a cheater. Everybody don't have to believe it, nor do they have to say it. Frankly, um, I thought that was weird. And then for Curtis with his bald head cheating at, so I cannot believe he was even talking in that entire conversation. It seems like he was remembering the times where he was cheating, where he still is still cheating, allegedly. Because why, Curtis, are you in it? We're going to have to get on you next because we know for a fact that that's what you is. So why are you in this conversation? Get off of my screen. Well, guys, if we don't know anything else about Dr. Damon, what we do know is he is most definitely a fan favorite, which is really good considering he is not on the show that much, um, but he is most definitely a fan fave. Um, you see a lot of women in particular in this situation that I have on the screen um, in which the women are wanting to take a picture with Dr. Damon because his personality just resonates with everyone. I mean, if you didn't have a husband or if you wasn't in a relationship um, with someone, you look at his mannerisms and you like, like, he looked like he can be a good husband. But again, we don't know anything. We just know what they show us and keep in mind, this is an hour long show. They're going to show us the greatest moments that they can. Although with his wife, she don't have a lot of great moments, which goes to her personality. And it you know, could very well be proven that Dr. Heavenly doesn't even act like this, but this is her character that she portrays on this show. And it's leading back to that question that we've been saying, because she doesn't want to talk about her real life. She doesn't want to reveal things in her real life. And she definitely does not want to talk about any allegations of infidelity while she is airing all of her classmates out for the exact same thing. You know, Mariah said it best. She has the receipts. She says she can bring the receipts. Um, is he a cheater? I don't know. I don't know. You can never look at a man or a woman and tell their true character. Um, it's pretty much what they do. Um, but, you know, Dr. Damon, you know, he, he doesn't want to, you know, be on the show that much. I mean, he's on there, but I believe he only does it. And he said this before to support his wife. Um, but if you can see him and Dr. Heavenly, they like night and day, but they've been married for I don't know how long. But Dr. Heavenly has told y'all, she don't care if he cheats. So maybe it's a situation where she don't care because she done told y'all that she ain't leaving her man. She don't care what he do. You know, that's a whole nother video. But again, I'm just here to report the information. But as Mariah said, she can bring the receipts. She said she got the receipts. So I don't know. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Receipts? Do I need to bring the receipts, oh, no. baby girl? Because oh, no. I got receipts. Oh, no. Do you want me to bring the receipts? Do I need to bring the receipts, oh, no. baby girl? Because oh, no. I got receipts. Oh, no. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. As always, let me know what you guys think in the comments. And also, make sure you enable your bell notification so you do not miss out on a video.